So what's good people, it's your boy TBC. I am back on the mic. I'm back to the Dragon Ball Z Xenoverse 2 discussion. Uh, don't forget to check our last discussion we had if you didn't get a chance to actually view that. But today what we're going to talk about is our beta, or I like to call them demos. There is a beta, but we're getting a Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2 beta. This is old news. It happened like two or three weeks ago. It's been confirmed. Well, not by Neko Bandai, but it's obvious. Everyone, everyone's talking about the demo. And here's the thing, right? What's going to be in our demo? So you let me know in the comment section below what do you think is going to be in this Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2 demo beta. It's a beta, whatever, but you let me know what you think is going to be in there. And here's your boy's TBC's opinions of what he thinks is going to be in this demo. Beta. Oh my goodness, the force have. I'm old school. And this beta. Now, if you remembered, um, in Xenoverse 1, we basically got a beta. Now, honest to God, I'm just me. Maybe it's my brain and how my brain operates, but I didn't understand nothing was happening in that beta. And it went out, it was supposed to be up for like a few days. They stretched that out the longest. Typically, most betas I've actually played, usually people stay there for a day or two, but they usually stretch out. So, I guess Xenoverse wanted to keep that, <laughs> keep that tradition going on. But, um, I recall when the beta first came out, all you had were Saiyans and the Mechians. And mostly, I saw 90% Saiyans and like 10% Mechians. Um, I didn't understand the system at first because me and my brain said how I work. I, I have to learn stuff on my own. It's just the way that, you know, I'm configured. The way that I was made. I have to learn stuff and experience my own. I didn't understand the beta. Um, but I'm, uh, since I played Xenoverse 1, I'm pretty sure I can understand the beta in Xenoverse 2. To a, to a T, but here's what I want in that beta, right? I basically want, um, I want three races to go around. This is gonna be on PS4 and Xbox One. I'm pretty sure they can do this. They can give you more races. I'm honestly hoping though that we can play that demo that a lot of people play at uh, Anime Expo, I believe. It, it was some, I can't remember. My, I'm, I just woke up from a nap, but I, I'm trying to remember that. But there was a demo that people got to play, and I'm hoping that we can get that demo. The demo, if you don't know, had uh, Kid Goku, GTAK, um, Future Trunks, Turtles, uh, Slug, Lord Slug, and my boy Janimba and Gogeta, and the Time Patroller. <laughs> Let's go. So I'm hoping that they actually give us that, and but I doubt it's going to be like that because it's going to be a beta. Um... It has me a little iffy, you know, but of course, I want some character customization. Of course, they can give us every single thing like they could, but give us some snippets of it, you know. I, I want to, I want to like a, a fourth a quarter build. Don't give us the, you won't give us the whole game, but I know they're going, because betas are mostly there to test out how games work and function stuff like that. Make sure the online is, is on point, but... You know, I'm hoping they give us a decent amount of stuff to work with because I want this to go to the public. I think everyone should somehow experience this game. Same thing I said with any time some people are able to play a game, but people don't. There needs to be something that goes around that basically lets us all be able to play the game. So, but like I said, here, here's what I want. Give me those characters. I want some already created characters. I want to just test the system out. I want to test the gameplay. I just want to get the feel of what Xenoverse is going to basically be. And with this beta, hopefully they'll let you do that. Um, I kind of got gripes with betas though at the same time. Um, not just Xenoverse, just uh, uh, bits. Like sometimes, I, I just want to experience the game on a one vCPU so I can get the feel of what the game's actual essence is going to be. Not necessarily the game's online infrastructure, if I'm making any sense. Um, I just hope that I'll be able to do just some computer battles so I can get the feel of what the system is before I go into the beta world. I doubt it's going to be like that though, because betas are mostly there to test the online uh, stability. But uh, yeah, that's basically what I really just wanted in this beta. I mean, of course, I'm hoping for it to be a demo or maybe it can be a beta demo or something like that. Something in the mixture. But if you guys didn't know, we're getting a beta. The release date for that, I'm going to say August. I would just say August. Um, some people are saying September or, or October, which is around the time the game comes out. No, man, I think it'll be in August. It'll be the earliest. I just figured that would be it because, like I said, some people got a chance to play the beta. I mean, since we got a chance to play a demo, so I would just assume that it would be around August-ish. Could be wrong here, but that's just a speculation date. You let me know what you think. What do you want in the Dragon Ball Z beta slash demo? And if you did know what's coming out, now you don't appreciate sure the whole world freaking knows at this point. This is kind of a stupid news. <laughs> but I want to talk about this. It's been something that's been on my mind for the longest. But you let me know what you think. On this channel, cover live Dragon Ball Z Universe discussion videos and anything that's of interest. Uh, if you want to be notified or want to get into discussion, don't forget to subscribe to the channel so you can see mostly videos on there. So you can be notified because I know a lot of people want to see these things. Later, guys. God bless. Peace. Have an amazing weekend. Spun drop day. Whatever time you're doing this video, stay tuned. Keep yourself up to date. Later, the Banana Nation. Bye, guys.